Hi, I'm Ana Sangronis, the Florida Sea Grant Extension Agent for the University of Florida IFAS Extension Miami-Dade County Program. I'm here today at Rookery Bay Research Reserve in Naples, Florida, where we're here to talk about and learn how to identify our three native mangrove species. We have the red, the black, and the white. We're gonna talk about a few different techniques that we can use to identify between these species. First, we're gonna start with the red mangrove. The red mangrove is probably the most easy to identify because of its very long arching prop roots that give the mangroves the appearance of walking on water. In addition, to my left, we have drop roots which go from the branch downwards to the water. This makes the red mangrove pretty easy to identify. Up next, we'll look at other techniques to distinguish between our two remaining species, the black and the white mangrove. The easiest way to identify between the three native mangrove species is to examine their leaves. The red mangrove has the largest leaf. It's very thick and waxy and more triangularly pointed towards the top. It's dark green, and on the underside, a little bit lighter green. In comparison, the black mangrove leaf is a lot more slender and elongated. It's green on top, and on the underside, it's lighter gray or even silverish in color. This is because black mangroves excrete salt through their leaves. Lastly, we have the white mangrove leaf, which is more rounded or paddle-shaped compared to the other two. At the top, there is a slight notch at the tip of the leaf. On the base, it's slightly reddish in color. And at the base of the stem are two round glands called nectaries. This is the best way to identify between your different mangrove species. The red, the black, and the white.